Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a beauty mail unboxing. I got a bunch of packages over the last couple of weeks. I have a huge package from CoverGirl, which I am so excited about. I got some things from Sephora, I ordered from BH Cosmetics, and then I have some miscellaneous things to show you guys. This video is more of like a vlog style. It's more laid back. I'm in my sweatpants. I'm on the ground. So hopefully you guys don't mind that. But if you want to see what I got recently, then just keep watching. Okay, let's start off with BH Cosmetics. So I've been seeing this palette going around on YouTube, and this is the BH Cosmetics Weekend Festival Palette. This is a stunning, beautiful palette, especially for the summertime. I wish I was going to Coachella, but sadly I'm not. Maybe next year, if I can get there, but this palette is so beautiful. I actually used it today. I only used two shadows from it, but it is really pigmented, and the shadows blend very easily. So this is what the palette looks like. It is so pretty, definitely a summer palette, and I cannot wait to use like these mint teals. Those are beautiful shades. The ones that I used today were Hippie and Swag, so the orange and the purple one, and they blended really, really nicely. And I only paid $14 for this. So I think it's usually like $20, but they always have discounts going on, and I paid $14. I highly recommend this palette. So far, so good. Such good quality for the price. Okay, also I got some things from Sephora. So Urban Decay lip liners are on sale right now. Highly recommend these as well because these are usually $20 and they're on sale for $10. Plus, there's an extra percentage off, I think, on the weekend. And then plus I had my discount, so I got these for $6 each and I picked up four shades. So the first one I got is called Broken, and this is a really pretty everyday nude. I actually already have this, but I wanted another one since it was on sale. So this is what it looks like, and then I'll do a swatch so you guys can see it better. But definitely like an everyday perfect nude. So I got that one. I think Urban Decay lip liners are my favorite. I always gravitate towards them. They're very creamy and long-lasting. The next one I have is called Insanity, and this one's more of like an orangey nude. But I actually have the lipstick, and the lipstick's really, really pretty. So just a little bit lighter than Broken and a little bit more warm. Then I got two brighter colors. This is so out of my comfort zone. But I got PDA, which is a bright pink. I'm usually always into the nudes or the nudie browns. But this one's very bright. But I think it would be really pretty for summer. So that's PDA right there. And then the last one I have is called Phone Call, which is like a coral. It's almost like a strawberry red. So this is what it looks like. And you will have to find out if I wear this because I don't know. We're gonna see, but I don't know if I can pull this off. So I got those four lip liners and then I got a couple more things. I got this Sephora Pineapple Nose Mask. I've been seeing this online and it looked really cute. So this is pore perfecting and smoothing. And this is the packaging. They changed all the packaging for the face mask, but I think this is so cute. And then I got the Grape Eye Mask. So this is good for smoothing and toning the eye area. And then I also got a mascara. This is my favorite mascara ever. This is the Tarte Lights Camera Lashes, and it's part of their Mermaid Collection. So it's that really pretty packaging. And I always am a sucker for packaging, but this really is my favorite mascara. So this is what it looks like. Love the color of this. And this gives great length and volume to your lashes. The wand doesn't look like anything crazy, but it really works well. So I got this mascara. So that's everything that I got from Sephora. Now I got this huge box from CoverGirl and I'm gonna show you what's in here because it's literally insane. It's the biggest package I've ever gotten. It was 15 pounds. And let's see if I can lift this up for you guys. So when you open it up, it looks like this. What does my face tell you? Does it say that I'm vain? Isn't it so cool? Or does it tell you that I'm strong? Then I'll run this company someday. I am obsessed. My face can be bold. It goes on and on, but I cannot believe there's a TV in there. Like the craziest package I've ever gotten and I'm so grateful. So thank you so much to CoverGirl. I'm gonna show you guys what's in the drawers because there are three drawers. So the first one says lips and you get a bunch of different lip products. So on the top are all the Katy Perry lip glosses and then on the bottom are the Queen collection and I think these are all liquid lipsticks. So, so many, so exciting. 
Then we have the second drawer, which is called Eyes. We have a couple different eyeshadow palettes, which I've swatched, and they're really, really nice. Then we have eyebrow pencils, eyebrow pomades, I think, and then liners and mascaras. So cool. You guys will see a lot of this in a giveaway because I'm definitely not keeping all of it for myself. And then the last drawer is called Skin. And we have some face powders in the middle. I actually took one of them out because I've been using it and I love it. And then we also have some skin tints, some cream eyeshadows or highlighters, color correcting palette, concealer, and then setting spray. So cool. So thank you so much to CoverGirl. That package was literally so amazing. Okay, moving on. So I received this free for review from Octoly. This is by the brand Alterna, and I got a shampoo and conditioner. I love the packaging of this. It's light pink, it's sleek. I really, really like it. And this is an anti-frizz shampoo and conditioner. So this is caviar anti-aging for medium to thick hair. I have not tried it yet, but I cannot wait to because I love trying out new shampoo and conditioner, especially ones that are sulfate free. So this is what it looks like, and I will let you know in like my vlogs if I like this. But like I said, I haven't tried this yet, but I am very excited too. So I'll link it down below for you guys if you're interested. Okay. Next, I received a package from a company called Monica Rose. So this girl Monica is so sweet, and I follow her on Instagram, and I love her boutique. She has a boutique, and she has the cutest clothes ever. And I liked this picture of her wearing this romper, and she actually sent it to me, so I thought that was really sweet of her. It's a light teal mint, and this is probably gonna throw my camera lighting off a little bit, because for some reason, mint always throws it off. But this is what it looks like. It's off the shoulder, very flowy, and it has like a floral butterfly design on it. And then it flows down like this. I love rompers, especially in the summer. They're very lightweight, they're very easy. And I think this is beautiful. So thank you so much to Monica. I can't wait to wear it. And you guys will definitely see me on Instagram wearing this outfit, because I love it. Okay, next. I have some eyelashes. This is from a company called iFancy, and it's actually a fellow beauty influencer who created these, which is so nice, and I love supporting other people. So this is from Jacqueline, and she came out with a bunch of lashes. So these are the packaging right here. It's called iFancy. The first one I have is called Elizabeth, and these are dramatic, like super, super dramatic. So this is Elizabeth. This probably will be a little bit too intense for me, but I'm still gonna give it a try. I feel like in pictures, this will look really nice. So that's what they look like right there. Very, very full. And then the other pair that she sent over was called Victoria. These I'm obsessed with. These are really pretty, very wispy, definitely my style, and I can't wait to use these. I will post a picture on my Instagram wearing these with a makeup look. Can't wait. So thank you so much for sending those over to me. The next thing I got in the mail is from Brigio, and this is a Scalp Revival Charcoal and Coconut Oil Micro Exfoliating Shampoo. And I did receive this free for review from Octoly as well. And I've used this in the past and I really like it, and I've also been using it over the last couple of weeks. But this is a really nice micro exfoliating shampoo, and basically what that does is it kind of takes all the dead skin cells from your scalp or any buildup of like of like product and it takes it out of your hair, which I think is a really cool concept. And sometimes you don't realize how much product you put in your hair, whether that's dry shampoo or hairspray, and it, a lot of it just builds up at your root. So you're supposed to put this into your root and work it down the ends of your hair. And I've been using this and loving it. Even Scott uses this because he puts like gel in his hair and it smells so good. I'll show you what it looks like because it looks like a charcoal paste. As you can see, I've been dipping into this, but it smells like a peppermint patty. It smells so nice and it feels very refreshing on the scalp. You can find this on Sephora.com and it just smells really, really good. So I'll link this down below for you guys. Okay, next I got some deodorant in the mail from Native Deodorant. So this is a paraben-free and aluminum-free deodorant brand. So this is what they look like. They sent me three and these are their new scents. So the first one I have is Leche and Goji Berry. And this one smells really nice. It smells very fruity and I'm into the fruity scents, especially for summer. So I really like this one, I can't wait to use it. Then we also have this one in Gardenia and Orchid. This one smells like straight up flowers. Like it is a very, very floral one. 
it smells nice but it's just almost like too florally for me personally and then the last one we have is called fig and honey which is the most light scented one it smells very natural and it smells like a little bit of honey just a light touch of honey but it smells really nice um, I might give two of these away in a giveaway, but I really, really like them, and I like how they're natural for you. So I'll link these down below if you guys are interested as well, if you want more of a natural deodorant, because some of the secret ones, um, those are not paraben-free, for the most part, for what I know. They're not paraben-free or aluminum-free, and those can actually cause your body damage, so we do not want cancer. Okay, I have a couple more things to show you guys. I have another pair of lashes. These are from Ilur. I did receive these free for review from Octoly. These are the Lux Silk Effect Lashes. They are reusable. I always use my lashes at least seven times. I just feel like it's a waste to just use them once. All you have to do is peel off the glue at the end of the night, reuse them the next day, you're fine. I don't usually put mascara on my lashes either because I feel like that would ruin them faster. So these are the lashes that I have. These look absolutely perfect. I can't wait to wear these. I feel like they look like wedding lashes and I'm very excited about it. I don't think I've tried too many lashes from Eyelure, so I'm excited to try these. And it also comes with a little glue inside. I think you can find these at like Ulta and I think I've seen them at Target too. But I'll link them down below if you guys are interested. These style are the Marquise, I believe. And they're very wispy and very like wedding-like. So very beautiful. Okay, the last package I have is from Urban Decay. And they sent me all of their lip glosses. So these are their new Hi-Fi Shine lip glosses. They ran out of the mailer that had like the cute box. It's okay that they ran out of the mailer because the product is in the inside and that's all I really care about. So we have all of these hi-fi shine lip glosses and they smell really good they feel really good on the lips they are not sticky and I'm probably gonna give a lot of these away to be honest but I wanted to show you a couple of my favorites so this one right here is called SPL and it's a light pink but it has like flecks of like purple and blue in it so this is what it looks like and I'll do a swatch so you can see it better but this one is like the prettiest one I'm obsessed with this one. So that's it right there. It's called SPL. Let me see if I can find another one. Oh, this one's pretty too. This one's called Midnight Cowgirl. And this one's a nude. A very light, natural nude. And I've been getting into glosses lately. I think they're coming back. So this is the packaging. It does have a shimmer to it. But it is not as intense as that other one. It's a very, very light shimmer. So that one right there is called Midnight Cowgirl. Very pretty. So thank you to Urban Decay for sending those over to me. I can't wait to play with them more. And that was everything that I got in the mail recently. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will link everything down below, and I will see you all in my next one. Bye.